Morning. All right. Is that everything? Right, finish up. I'm going. What, I've hardly had a bite yet. Coffee, please. You right? What's Phil got you being a coffee monkey, is he? No, I've got a thing on today, working away. Oh, yeah, we up to? Oh, just this and that. I ain't a copper, Keanu. Just uh, wondered if you fancy a little lunchtime pint, that was all. Cheers. Uh, maybe another time. Better get on. All right, mate. Do as I say. Stay away from me, you understand? No, no. Yeah, but I'm not deaf. Bunk it off. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> Don't get me wrong, I love her to bits, but looking back, I probably would have given myself a few more years. I was only a kid. <laughs> oh, get him, Ren. You two need the room, innit? Hey. <laughs> no. Oh, we're just mates. The gang is all here. What's everyone having? Same again, Jay? Yeah, got it, mate, yeah. Ben Mitchell. Uh, Callum Highway. <laughs> <laughs> Blimey, wit, I can hardly keep up with you and all your men. Um. <clears throat> Two pints of lager when you're ready, mate. So, you two been here long? Nice. I wouldn't have put you two together, but I suppose it takes all sorts. Not your usual type, Whit. Well, I know how lucky I am. Besides, you've got to kiss a couple of frogs before you find your stallion, ain't you? Mm. Well, I suppose you better hop over there then, Kermit, because you've got another customer. Excuse me. So I told the landlord, right, either he lets it go or I'm stripping out the electrics, the plumbing, and he, he walked away from it. So you basically just done him over? It's business. <laughs> Stick another one in there when you get off your high horse, won't you? Go on, Jay, it's your round. I'm sorry, I didn't... She's taken Lexi for some ice cream. Hmm. Where did you two sneak off to? Hmm? Catching up, where? Well, old times and that. I'm talking to you. You can't tell me I can and can't see Ben. I don't need permission. <laughs> Get your hands off of me! You don't talk to me like that. I don't like it. Do you understand? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Nothing is going to stop us from doing what we came here to do. Is that clear? Especially not some pathetic little crash that you think you could just, what, dig up? I mean, didn't you hurt him enough before? Hmm? Jay wouldn't want you anyway. I mean, how do you think he's going to feel when he finds out about your fiancé. 